In today's video, I want to show you how to display more than one screen at the same time on, on your uh, Windows 10 desktop. So uh, right now I have a Word document open, I have Windows Explorer open, I have an uh, internet browser open, and I have an Excel spreadsheet open as well. All right, so now one thing that you can do is you hold down the Alt uh, key at the bottom of the keyboard, you look for Alt and, you, and then you do Tab. And then notice how that'll display all the open windows. Hold down Alt and just uh, do Tab. Now I'm, my, my thumb is still on the Alt key. And then you just kind of tab through the different windows. So to get that window to show up, I did, you hold down Alt and then you do Tab. And then just hold down your thumb on the uh, Alt key, for example, so you can scroll through the open windows. So let me go back to the Word document. Now let's see how we can show two windows in the same time. So here's the Word document. I'm going to move my mouse up to the title bar right there. And then you're going to hold down your left mouse button and just hold it down. And you're going to pull that window off. Now you drag it all the way to the left or all the way to the right uh, until that little ghost image comes up. I'm going to keep on dragging it. See how that little ghost image comes up. And then that'll fill that half of the window. Now it'll show you the other uh, open uh, programs and you can pick one of those. So I'm going to go to the Excel document and click that and that'll fill the other side of the window. All right, so let's maximize both of those windows and try that again. I'll maximize the Excel spreadsheet and I'll maximize the Word document. Watch again. I'm going to move my mouse up to the title bar. I'm going to hold down my left mouse button, drag it over. You can drag it to the left or to the right until you see that little ghost image. Then you lift your finger. Then it'll ask you which of the other windows you want to fill on the other side. So this time I'll pick on the, uh, the desktop. Now here you want to pick in the middle of that window. Good. And now both of those windows are displaying. Each one is taking up half the screen. Now uh, in Windows 10, you can actually show um, two windows like I just showed you, or you can show three or even four. I'm going to maximize all these windows again. Let's try to go for uh, three windows. So I'll pick up the Word document from the title bar. Now this time when I drag it over to the left, I'm going to get the ghost image. When you get the ghost image, you move it all the way to the top. You see how if you look at the, uh, the ghost image, now it's only uh, a quarter of the screen. So watch again. You move it to the left, you get the ghost image, and then you kind of move it up until it fills one quarter of the page. Good. Now I'll go to uh, the Excel document and I'll pick on the Excel document and we're going to get the title bar. Now I'm going to move that one to the left of the screen until we get the ghost image. Then you move it down all the way. Now you have to move this one all the way down until that fill. See how the ghost image is only filled in a quarter of the page now. You have to move it all the way down. And then I have both of those windows. Now it wants to know which window I want to fill on the uh, right side of the window. So this time I'll pick on the, uh, the web page. Good. So now I have three windows on the screen at the same time. Uh, so watch what we did again. I'll maximize those windows. All right. So I'm going to pick up the Excel spreadsheet from the title bar. And I'm going to drag it over. You can even drag it to the right this time. I'll drag it to the right. Get the ghost image. Now I'm going to move it up to the top until the ghost image fills uh, a quarter of the screen. Good. Now I'll pick up the uh, Word document, get the title bar, drag it over to the right. You get the ghost image and you move that down until the ghost image only fills a quarter of the screen like that. Perfect. Now it wants to know which window is going to fill the left side of the window and I'll make it um, the web page. Good. So now I have three windows open at the same time. Now to get four, we'll do the same thing over here on the left. I'll pick up the, uh, the web page from the title bar and I'll move it so I get the ghost image. There it is. I'll move that up so the ghost image only fills uh, a quarter of the page. Good. Now it wants to know which uh, is going to fill the, the last quarter. So I'll pick on the uh, Windows Explorer window. And now I have four windows open at the same time. So it's really just a great technique. And now you can uh, display two, three, or four windows on the same screen at the same time. Just run through that one more time. I'm going to maximize this window. Pick up that window from the title bar. 
And if you drag it all the way to the left, you, you, uh, then um, the ghost image will fill. You kind of see what happens. The ghost image fills that part of the screen. Now, if you move it up, then you can make it fill just a quarter of the page like that. Then uh, now that I have three windows open, I'll pick on a different one. And now I have four windows open. And then when you're moving it so it fills the bottom of the page, you're going to pick up that window from the title bar. You move it over either to the left or to the right to get the ghost image. You drag it all the way down. And then you'll notice how the ghost image is now going to fill just a quarter of the page. So uh, now remember also when you hold down Alt and then do Tab, then you can toggle through the windows that way also. So now you can see how you can display two, three, or even four windows at the same time in Windows 10.